and welcome to PLOS Video Shorts. This video is for our editorial board members who'd like to learn more about initiating a discussion in our submission system, Editorial Manager. Editors can initiate a discussion with their fellow editorial board members and the journal team throughout the whole editorial process. In this particular example, we will use a submission which is ready for an associate editor's decision after review. You will therefore find your manuscript in the Submissions with Required Reviews Complete folder from the Associate Editor main menu. Look to the action links in the left-hand column of your manuscript and select the Initiate Discussion link. If there have been previous discussions on the submission, this link will appear as Discussions instead. This will open a pop-up window. First, enter your topic, which is synonymous to the subject line of an email, and then enter the body of your message in the field, Initial Comments. You are now ready to select your participants. You can search for your chosen participants by name or email using the available criterion. In this case, we will search by the criterion last name. Once you've entered your value, click search and the results will be returned. Please check that the participants are available by taking a quick look at the availability column on the right hand side. Once you're ready to proceed, select your participant by checking all the available tick boxes. This will grant discussion participants full access to the submission, including the manuscript, reviews, and draft decision letter. Note that for PLOS pathogens, the tick boxes are already pre-selected, but for PLOS NTDs, you'll have to manually select these tick boxes. You can select multiple participants at this point, although we ask you to ensure that you restrict invites only to the relevant editorial board members. We would also recommend always including a member of the journal team as well. For PLOS pathogens, you will loop in the staff account by searching with the last name criterion staff. Once you have selected your participants, click proceed to customize letters. Please do not open a discussion by selecting start discussion without sending letters, as this will mean that the participants are not notified of the discussion and you will not receive a timely response. On the following page, you will have the option to customize the discussion invite if you wish. This is not essential, though, as the letter will be auto-populated with a link to the discussion forum alongside your initial comments. Finally, click Confirm Selections and Send Letters. You have now set up your discussion. You can access this again by selecting Discussions from the Manuscript Action Links then click View. On the following page, you have the option to add a new comment to the discussion, add new participants, and view the materials associated with this submission. You will also be notified by email if a participant comments within the forum. Thanks for watching this PLOS video short. For more information and videos like this one, please visit our PLOS Media YouTube channel.